When a xylophone maker sees a nice hard piece of Honduras rosewood, he begins to make notes, the musical and resonant notes which only this wood can give. Planing, sawing and trimming and the long strips of wood are cut into notes giving roughly the desired pitch. It's rather interesting to learn that a more resonant tone is obtained by hollowing the wood. So the wood notes are made with a slightly higher pitch than that desired and then the middle is scraped out to give the correct pitch. Increased vibration is obtained by these resonators. They must, of course, have the same pitch as the wood notes and are tuned by raising or lowering a metal cap in the tube. All things, or rather notes, being equal, assembling becomes a simple matter, the notes being placed over the corresponding tubes. And now we are going to introduce the celebrated player, Harry Robbins, who will show you how easy it is to play the xylophone when you know how. <laughs> 